I meant to show you this and I somehow got um, finished this video without t telling you this let me find um, this this day has a has another interesting tie-in to everything let me show you okay so just to remind you that this is where the conversation started was at this documentary I tried to find this on um, on um, Wikipedia and they don't have you know they have a page on everything but they I did not find a page just on this documentary so this is a page on the heritage which produced the documentary they have a page on on everything here like saw everything they don't have a page on this that's because I would like to know you know they always put the numbers up behind these documentaries and there's a there would be a lot of numbers to analyze if they would just have a page on this well um okay so what I want to show you is hold on so I was looking at a lot of the different days um, in October based on various clues that we found this day uh, has an interesting um, time diameter but not only that another way to tell these time diameters is by finding out their divisibility by 9-11 and if that fits into the code now this is kind of like a 747 so that's something that we maybe need to take a look at plus this day 1010 is kind of like the Rockefeller number and it also has to do with some of their other numbers that they like like 11 and 10 but as far as this movie this is a, this is a 474 now we saw inverted numbers with um, Oregon um, the shooting it had Oregon has um, 232 I should show you this huh Okay, so as far as the Oregon Umqua shooting, this is this is the gematria of Oregon. Now, um, another thing to pay to to notice is that it happened on the one two three meridian, and we had a lot of counting up and counting down numbers with the Pope um, series. I did a long series. I know there's a lot of them, so that's just you don't have to watch it if you don't want to. But there there are a lot of um, tie-ins actually with these numbers. So. The other thing I want to um, point out, this 7-4 right here, this is, um, Oregon is the only state, according to Zachary K. Hubbard, who, that has this gematria, and it's the 33rd state. It has um, this 1-2-3 meridian in it, that's where the shooting happened. Um, I did that in Google Earth on the, on the video about the Umqua shooting, so you can go and check that out. Well, we need, we need, if there's some smart people who know how to make this code, I would like a website that does this gematria and some other gematrias. I have a gematria that I would like to constantly analyze called a menorah gematria and it's a very simple calculation so I'd like to have that side by side with all these other gematrias but also I would like to have the inversions. I'd like to be able to press a button and come up to the inversion because this is what they do and we need to have it side by side. Um, also I'd like to know who the operators of a site like this are. And then I think everybody should, it'd be like, it should be like you go to like a guitar chord place and you have your own songbook. You should have your own library so that you don't have to look at everybody else's library. You could pick and choose out of their library or people could rate these different things and then you could, you know, pick the, the top rated findings and that way you could have a library that actually um, is nice and clean. Okay, so what I want to show you is this inversion here between Oregon, Lucifer, all of these numbers, other numbers are the same. Um, this 4-4 number does come up in this very same episode that I've been analyzing lately. Oh, not, not the Hoover Dam episode, but the um, Season 2, Episode 3 episode. I, I didn't look at the 4-4 number in the Hoover Dam episode. Um, so I'll, I'll bring you this 4-4 number in the season, um, in the 23. I'm just going to call it the 23. Since 23 is such an important number, it's the 23 episode, except for it's not the 23rd episode. It's the season two, episode three. Well, this is what I'm paying attention to because this number is everywhere, plus um, this inversion. The reason why this number matters, having to do with the Oregon shooting, is that if you go to my, if you go and watch that video, there's an alignment on their campus, and I love to take a look at their alignments because I notice that, first of all, I'm the only person who ever takes a look at the alignments, but also they make those alignments very carefully and on that campus there's a, there's two spokes um, and we know that uh, spokes it's like a bicycle spoke on the campus and there's eight parts on each of them 
that's an 88, that's a bicycle sign. In the movies, we see that having to do with disaster. I told you about the um, Armageddon movie having to do with the day after movie in which there's this same character, um, a black guy on a bicycle with a dog in the basket, and he has a raincoat on, and one of them has a question on his forehead, and he's the watcher type. He's the, he's the introspective, calm person, everything, all hell's breaking loose, but he's looking around for clues. And um, he's also an outsider. So that character is there both, and often um, the some bicycles and bicycle scenes have to do with um, a Christ or a watcher type of person. So, he, yeah, that's that's as far as I've analyzed that. I'm just, um, but um, anyway, the the spokes between the uh, the two hubs of the two wheels, the eight parted wheels in the, on the Umcock campus has this heading and I didn't draw it out yet well okay so back to so this is why I'm caring about the set the, the 74s the 474s and the 747s and then this number where to go 810 I'm looking for it yes this number that is divisible by 9-11 um, and then you know it would be nice to have a program like this that has a calculator on here that you could program the calculator to check you know like six major dates Let's check the divisions of six major dates and then as soon as you come up with a date you know maybe you'd have you know one of these type of calculators also in this so that we could just have it all side by side because then all these numbers are really going to pop out. You see that I have to go back and forth between all of these. Um, I have to hold these numbers in my head and that's not always working for me. So also to point down uh, here, I already pointed this out, but there's a 816 number down here and that's a Georgia Guidestone number. And this is the 68 number, the stock market number. I do believe the stock market is going to have another major fall and it, it's just a preamble for the co final financial collapse and if they succeed in doing that that's going to make you know a lot of turbulence for people because money is going to be a great disturbance in money in the money flow especially people who uh, need to buy things they, that they basically can't stock up and survive for three years like they need medicine or something like that those people that it's going to be some difficulty if the if we have a full financial collapse so this stock market number here is a little worrisome having to do with uh, these dates now um sorry let me think what i was going to all right just taking a look here at the heritage foundation i wanted to tell you that i saw a movie last night oh my computer's frozen here um I saw a movie last night called The Age of Adeline, and that movie had a comment in it, and the, and 81 numbers, um, and we've seen some 118 numbers um, tied up with this situ with this these um, foreshadowings, but there were a lot of 10 numbers in Adeline. Now, um, I don't know if people have seen that. I was just uh, gematuring everything by hand uh, that I could come across. Um, Adeline with my calculations is 50 so that would be the the 50 states and that would be the age basically of you can see like in the movie she's um, she goes into a, a protect um, like a whirlpool of like, where she no longer evolves or she no longer ages and it, and it happens for a hundred and seven years so I want to look at October 7th because um, that would be the 24th of the, the, the September 24th equivalent. Well, anyway, so she's, she lit, she, uh, at the age of 107, she has another near death experience and there are, they count down the numbers in this movie. And it's interesting because I had just, before I watched the movie, I had just been calculating this with the 10 right here. Now it's got the 13 in it, but this is the number from the 10. I had just been calculating that and they count that down again in the movie and they tie it to a comet because the comet's presence in the solar system causes snow. Oh yeah, 
that's right. Hold on. Okay, so this is the one. I, this And this one really has the 747 on it and the 911. This is the one I wanted to show you. And then I got confused by the time I got to the end of that other video. Do you see this? Anna has the 86. I want to show you how many 911s are in... Well, I already showed you some of them in Hoover Dam. I was looking at it again, and they had... They, the Hoover Dam was open until 9-11 and then they basically put that extra bypass there because of 9-11 they named it 93 which um, goes back to September 30th so here we are I want to come down here because it's way at the bottom there's a, there are a lot of numbers in here Okay, so it all talks about, so it talks about, um, they, um, at 9-11, they were all, all this traffic was diverted to 95, this is the slave number, or Nevada routes, um, 6-3 and, and 163 and 68. This would be, a, this would be another 39. Having to do with the, the when this, um, I guess you could say the birth of the Hoover Dam, the birthday. It's the dedication day. They, they pick the dedication day. It doesn't matter because they can't, you know, of course, have their construction work perfectly, so they have to, they, it doesn't matter because they can put, pick their dedication day perfectly. So the dam again closed. Modified tours. And so I just wanted to show you how sensitive they were to this. There's a, there are a lot more 911s besides this as well. Oh, the other, I think I showed you this one about the temperature. I was showing my husband last night and then I was like did I show them this yeah I think I did show you this now this number we know is one of their very favorite numbers because it's 11 3 is the opening of the Freedom Tower 311 is Fukushima I could bring up both of those Wikipedia's and we could have a lot of fun another really fun app to have would be say I had three um, three or four pages open, especially Wikipedia's, and I could tie them all together with one number. I could search on each of them, one number, and it would basically tie them all together, like a 113. And it would search these permutations, because it would know that they put a gateway in here, it'd be upside down, or, you know, the mirrors of that. But this is one of their very favorite numbers. So, I, I did analyze the movie, um, San Andreas, it has to do with the crashing of Hoover Dam. And I wasn't looking for 113s at the time. Actually, I just looked at the, um, at the trailer. So now I'm very interested to look at that and see, look for 113s. I remember there was a lot of 528s. In fact, on the helicopter tail, they, they just put 528s everywhere. And I do feel like they were planning something on 528. They had all the prophets come out and they were planning something. And I think there was an actual planetary alignment and they were going to try to, you know, the will of God type of thing. And they were going to put nukes in the fault. And I think that their nukes failed. And the only explanation for the nukes falling is positive military on the, uh, failing is positive military on the ground or positive star people slash military on the ground so that's very interesting I don't know if they're gonna take another try at it or if that's what they're if that's what this date is about here this is equivalent to the 930 day and it's so interesting how they keep using this number again and again and I showed you this in the long count of pie where on my um, 4 and 20 blackbirds baked in a pie series that the placement code here is 816 and 618 I think it's 816 and I think it's the first 816 on the first thousand digits of pi they love that number. So the Heritage Foundation that put out this documentary, 33 Minutes, that's not on Wikipedia, um, this is what Heritage um, shares Gematria with. Nimrod, Egypt, Nibiru, uh, Jackson, very, they, they love this name, Jackson, Hiram Abif, United, and Sacrifice. This it, oh, I keep I keep meaning to remember this children now other people's names are going to also match these things so don't get upset if your name matches some of these things 
it's because it's because if if they weren't contaminating um, by purposely spinning the frequency, like taking a good frequency and putting a bad association on it. Like, I think that 9-11 is supposed to be a good frequency, and then they put sacrifice on it. If they weren't purposely spinning it, and all of these frequencies were unmanipulated and uncontaminated, you would have a grouping of associations that's very, very similar. You wouldn't have opposites here. But because they are manipulating, they're, they, they're trying to hide this because they have their own websites and we have to use these ones. But they have their own websites where they can filter out the ones that are manipulated. But because they manipulated these frequencies, uh, that's why we have all the whole spectrum in here. So if your name matches some of these things, uh, don't get upset. Now, because we have this one where, it's, where it has everything in it, it, it does sort of help us because then we're sort of able to see the breadcrumbs that were left by the frequency manipulation where they take a name and then they put negative um, events on it. So just take a look at the American um, Enterprise Institute because they, the Heritage Foundation and the American Instru uh, Enterprise Institute co-hosted this Republican Party presidential candidate on this day and they are the ones who made this documentary that's not in Wikipedia with these numbers. This documentary has very kind of alarming numbers here. It does it does match also blasphemy, so it could mean that it's a complete lie. Well, I'll just leave you with this um, this day. This is the we, we could also put in um, actually, I, maybe I won't leave you. Maybe I'll put in a few more dates. This is the Simpson um, episode date where the Hoover go, Dam goes down. This is the equivalent, the Gregorian equivalent of 930. So we have these very suspicious numbers we've been seeing again and again, and when we divide it, which this happens, if this was the first one that I found in Simpsons, I would be way out on a limb, but this is this is like the sixth one I found, and I've only I've only done like seven or eight calculations. Okay, well, this, the dedication of the dam until 10-13-2015 has a 9-11 number, but it also has this 233 number. So this is very similar to the 223 number of the, two, um, the February 23rd release of that Simpsons episode about the, the, the breaking down of the dam. I don't know, it's just something to consider, something to know. It might be a date that we should watch, because my whole reason besides education and having fun coping with the news is to perhaps be able to predict something. So that would be fun if we could predict something. But we d we're just learning the ropes, so I'm not, I'm okay if I'm wrong, we're just learning the ropes. Alright, love you guys, talk to you later.